Hello drone video fans and my name is Bill and this is the uh, first shoot I've made with my new uh, Autel Evo uh, UAV. So we're out at a familiar place in the picnic area of uh, Geneva State Park which is the only place uh, you're allowed to fly uh, drones or UAVs now that they implemented the uh, state uh, rules. So we took it up to uh, 230 feet over the parking lot. Why 230 feet? Well, you can see in the distance there is a cell tower that's at 220 feet. <laughs> so that was the reason we, we chose that. And we're uh, going to fly some, about a one about one kilometer out to the um, part where the uh, channel open goes out into uh, Lake Erie. Uh, this was a sort of a shakedown run. Uh, we've been flying uh, uh, camera UAVs for quite some time, and uh, but there's there's a learning curve that goes with every new one. So uh, we have a lot to learn yet uh, about this new one. And uh, so the first thing we thought we would do is fly over the uh, marina here and uh, try to use the. Um, uh, zoom feature. This ca this camera does have the zoom feature. We did a 2x zoom here, and as you can see, when you use the zoom, it, it kind of uh, skews the uh, centering of the uh, video, which you can adjust then with uh, by using the uh, gimbal pitch. So um, that was our first uh, time at using that. Now we switch back to uh, 1x zoom, regular regular uh, video, and we're going to uh, you can see the uh, cell tower there on the left going to line up here and go out towards the channel opening where all the boats head out to uh, get into Lake Erie. In the uh, upper right uh, of the picture you can see a sailboat and had I been paying more attention I may have uh, tried to venture out there and go and visit that uh, sailboat. You'll see uh, quite a few seagulls flying beneath me and uh, we're coming up on a lighthouse that's on the right hand uh, uh, channel uh, marker here and if you've been around my channel for any length of time you've probably seen videos that I've done before on that uh, uh, on that lighthouse so what we're gonna do is is uh, kinda line up here and, and go again using the, the 2x zoom to uh, take a look at that uh, lighthouse remember we're about 230 feet up at this point so but effectively we're looking at it from like 115 feet and uh, just showing the the whole channel here and uh, we're gonna go back to uh, regular 1x uh, normal view here turn back around and and start heading back across the marina and um, in, in order to get uh, another chance to try and use the uh, the zoom feature now remember this is a digital zoom so although it can go up to uh, 8x 8 times uh, in zoom uh, the more you zoom it uh, the more pixelization you'll see and notice in the uh, in the picture there goes a boat leaving out through the channel so what I thought I'd do is fly over uh, this is the uh, expensive row of uh, boats that are in dock here and fly over them and then use the uh, zoom and here we're gonna kinda line up on these and, and we can uh, get a pretty good look at uh, some of these. Most of these are 30 plus foot uh, uh, I don't know if you would call them yachts but uh, I, I guess the term you've heard me use this joke before that the term boat stands for break out another thousand <laughs> and in this case uh, maybe it applies. There's there's of course electrical hookups and satellite dish hookups and uh, the people that own these uh, uh, boats or yachts or whatever are um, you know probably capable of doing that. We have uh, so those boats that you see lined up in a row are charter boats that take people out for fishing. You also see some uh, places for people to back in their uh, boats uh, ramps there that are on the side and uh, now we're going to uh, take a quick pass over uh, what is known as a, a uh, natural wetland and I, I shot this um, I don't know a year or two ago with my uh, old uh, X380 and the, at the time that I shot it the gimbal was kind of uh, acting up which it has a tendency to do once in a while and 
so the the video wasn't very stable so we um, we enjoyed this opportunity here to uh, still flying at the at the altitude but uh, using the 2x zoom um, we were able to get a, a much better view of this uh, natural wetland area there are egrets blue heron and um, other uh, unusual birds that that uh, hang out hang out in this area it's unfortunate that we didn't get a chance to to see any of them uh, in this uh, in this particular video but uh, uh, I, I have seen them uh, when biking through this uh, through this area so uh, we're heading back now again this is the second part of the natural wetlands area um, and of course that's you know protected and all that uh, but we're heading back generally in the direction of where we took off from uh, in the parking lot uh, which is for picnicking uh, in the in the very back area of the of the um, Geneva State Park and we'll be panning the uh, the camera up and I've got to uh, learn to adjust uh, EV exposure values uh, on the fly as I uh, do with my uh, other drone here here you can see we've already adjusted them and we're coming back down into the parking lot and you can see my car there at the end and me standing there and um, we're uh, gonna line it up here and, and uh, do one more uh, do one more test of the zoom we'll, we'll stop it uh, part way to uh, where we're standing and then use the uh, 2x, 2x zoom to uh, zoom in just to, to see how it it uh, works with a uh, uh, a human in the in the picture so uh, that's what this with test was all about and you can see the effect of going to uh, a 2x zoom from uh, um, being in a 1x zoom we're getting ready to land here and uh, this is a view uh, of the landing with the camera we also had a hat cam on at the time so you'll be seeing that hope you enjoyed this uh, first uh, flight and quick uh, shoot with the uh, Autel Evo you'll be seeing more videos from this uh, drone coming up uh, late, later on so stop back again thanks for visiting the channel and uh, come back soon